What Jesus is saying here is this. Abraham, as he took up his journey by faith, saw Christ's day, saw Jesus. He knew of what Jesus was going to do. Now, we don't get that in the narrative in Genesis chapter 12. But Jesus, who was before Abraham, is telling us that Abraham saw his day and was glad. He saw his day by faith and he knew that if he followed God, that if he believed God, that one day God would send his Messiah to be the redeemer of the world. That one day the Messiah would raise from the dead and to bring all who believe into him uh, unto him everlasting life. Abraham saw Jesus's day and was glad. This is why we can say that no one enters into the life of faith or the journey of faith opposite of following Jesus Christ. We must know Jesus Christ if we are to go on to this journey of faith because Jesus is God's way. Jesus is the way to God. Now, there are also individuals who will say, or as some might say, well, you know, I never have heard the call. Well, obviously you have heard the call. You know that Jesus is the only one who can save you. It is upon you to either choose to follow him or to reject him. But still, there are also individuals who will say, sure, I'll take up this journey of faith. But then I'll get right off of it. You see, what they see, what they think about Jesus' sacrifice is this. They say, I believe that Jesus died on the cross for my sins. Now I know that my sins are forgiven. And so I'm just going to get right back on the journey of sin that I once was on because I've got my get out of hell free card. I can continue in sin so that grace might abound. I don't need to worry about the life I live after entering into the life of faith with Jesus Christ. I don't need to stay on that narrow path. I can go on the broad path. Because, you know, the journey that I was on, I took a little detour, found Jesus, Jesus saved me, and now I'm just going to go live it up, you know, however it is that I want to live. That is not what God calls us to when he calls us to this journey of faith in Jesus Christ. 